Hey guys, let's talk about light. Let's talk about darkness. You know, uh, on YouTube, you can look at different channels and there's actually some people that will have their websites will be real dark and they're really into darkness and mostly like the occult, uh, people in witchcraft, Satanists, things like that. As if there's power in darkness. When I know, because I've read the Bible, that darkness flees from the light. Or do you not know that when the light is shown in the darkness, the darkness fears the light and it hides from the light? There's also some quotes where people will say, yeah, well, there's no, there wouldn't be any light without the darkness. Well, that's kind of stupid. The thing I look at is, what is more powerful, the light or the darkness? And the light is more powerful than the darkness. Or have you not read where the Bible says, and this is the condemnation that light has come into the world. But men love darkness more than the light. Why do they like darkness? Because they can hide their evil within the darkness. But it, it says all who come to the light want their good deeds to be exposed. So you can tell, like people that are all into darkness and everything, they're just, they're evil. <laughs> they want to hide their evil within the darkness. But when you're in God's will, you want to bring your good works to light so you can praise Him. When you're outside of God's will, you hide in the darkness. It is interesting, when Adam and Eve sinned, they hid themselves. So many parallels. Uh, Jesus says He is the light that has come into the world. Light is more powerful than darkness. Now, this Sunday, we're going to be talking a lot about light and dark, good and evil. We will be exposing the shocking secrets of witchcraft, paganism, atheism. We're going to be proving to you that atheism is a religion, it's a humanist religion. We'll be talking about secret rituals that witches do. Oh yes complete with 100% undeniable shocking evidence. We will be talking about what the Bible says about paganism, the worshiping of nature, what God thinks about it, the praying with trees, what God thinks about it. We will be Shining light in the darkness is what we're going to be doing. That's this Sunday at 10 o'clock at our radio show. I am already receiving <laughs> a lot of angry, uh, not threats, but they're wondering why would we would have the gall, have the audacity to do this show where we expose the secrets of witchcraft, paganism, atheism. Secrets they do not want you, yes you, to know. Well, you know why we're doing it? Because that's what light does. Light shines in the darkness. It exposes evil. And that's what we do. Jesus said, which of you has a lamp and you put it underneath the bushel or you put it underneath the bed. He said, no, you put it in the middle of the room so everybody can see your light. They can see your good works and glorify your God who is in heaven. And that's what we're going to do. We will be shining light on some very evil things. Things that they don't want you to know. They're already trying to stop us from doing it. They are freaking out. The cauldrons are stirring. The spells are being cast. The trees are being prayed to. All to get us to stop this radio show scheduled for Sunday 
Now, it's Sunday, 10 o'clock my time, but if you'd like to see when it is scheduled your time, and believe me, there's going to be a lot of people there. Click more info and go to shockonnow.net, and you're going to see a little picture of the motorcycle I'm riding on. Click that motorcycle, and that'll take you to the radio page. Do not run from the light. Come to the light. I'm going to be talking about 1 John 3.18, where it, it talks about all of us already under condemnation. You know, Jesus Christ said, those that believe in Him, Jesus Christ, are not condemned. Praise God. Hallelujah. But then it says, and this is Jesus' own words, that those who do not believe in Him are condemned already. And then He says, why? He says, one reason why. Because they did not believe in God's only son but I believe I am not condemned and it is my job as a Christian to shine light on the subject to shine light on evil and we're going to let the chips fall where they may Maranatha God bless you guys click more info and I'll see you Saturday or Sunday at the radio show